This is Ice Cream Gecko and in today's video we're going to take a look at the Rittersport Goldschatz Whole Milk Chocolate. Uh, this is not ice cream, this is not another frozen food, nor is it fast food, but uh, it's Christmas right now and the shops are closed, so I'm sticking to what is available. Uh, let's take a quick look at the nutrition table first, pause if you want to read that and pause if you want to read the ingredients list. 145 grams of, what is it, whole milk chocolate with uh, at least 40% of cocoa. Wonderful. Uh, here is the address of the company if you want to send them angry letters. And uh, we're going to do the classic thing with this chocolate and we're going to break it apart like that. Then it's open already, and then we can open it for all the rest to retrieve quite a few little chocolate pieces right here. Let's zoom in just a little bit. Looks pretty good, pretty classic with the Rittersport logo on here. And uh, let's actually slice this in half, or oh, well, get a bit of a cross section right here. And yes, it does look rather simple and nothing really going on there. Uh, at least 40% of chocolate, what it was, I think. Um, yes, <laughs> so I'm going to taste this now because it's been a while since I had whole milk chocolate that was this simple from Rittersport. And it seems like the only thing golden about this is the packaging itself with a little reindeer on the front for Christmas. Wonderful. So after the taste test of this one, I've got to say that, I'm, uh, that I've got mixed feelings about this. Um, we've got 40% of chocolate in there, well at least 40%, but it still is, it doesn't taste very premium at all. Uh, usually with those, those higher cocoa content chocolates, they, they taste nice, but other than this being labelled as a brand chocolate, this tastes very much like, I don't know, Aldi chocolate used to taste like. It's it's too sweet and it's too, I don't know how to say it, it the, the whole milk chocolate always, it, it, it's difficult to get right, I, I feel, um, because it never really tastes very creamy, I guess, it's, it's, it's an odd texture and this one doesn't taste very premium overall at all. So um, I can't really give this uh, a great rating, so yeah, I guess as a cheap gift for somebody for Christmas or something. Uh, if you can get away with the chocolate bar then this uh, certainly isn't a bad thing because the packaging looks nice but the stuff inside is very standard and um, well it, it, it's not the greatest so I wouldn't recommend this as a Christmas present for the people you love. Overall this is this is a four and a half out of ten and uh, I think I'm going to leave it at that. If you've got a question or a video suggestion, leave it in the comment section down below. And if you want to see more videos just like this one, please subscribe. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you have a great remainder of the Christmas days. And maybe uh, we're going to see each other before the new year arrives and 2020 is finally done and over with. Anyways, thanks again for watching and take care. Bye-bye.